Hey guys, Jose here, and I want to show you our loadable dumbbell. So basically, you want to think of them like a barbell, right? But it's a dumbbell instead, because as you can see here, you can easily adjust and change the plates, right? With um, the same plates that you use for uh, barbells, right? So except for the bumper plates that go like 10 kg or up, because they're way bigger. So bumper plates is a no-go. We have two different lengths, so one here, and we'll put the specs in a bit. So they're different lengths, as you can tell here. So obviously this bar here is uh, can, can accept more load than the other. If you look closely, they're not the same length, right? Uh, for the inside where you put your handle, they're not the same length. So you need to consider that as well. You can use different types of clips. So we have this clip here, and we have this clip here. So feel free to use whatever clips you want. Again, they're both good for the bar, barbell and the dumbbells. So it just makes your uh, home gym way more versatile now when you get these bad boys. We also do carry the rubber grip plates, which is great. As you can see here, this is like a rubber coating plate as well, right? Um, this is in pounds, so they're almost the same size. And the load capacity, I guess, five times two, I think that's 50 kilos in each, or for each bar of a dumbbell bar. So that's quite a lot. So now I'm gonna show you a few exercises that you can do, which you typically can't do on the barbell. All right, first exercise, hammer curls. Obviously you could still do um, curls with a barbell, but it doesn't feel the same because you don't have that, you know, the movement in your wrists, right? Independent from each arm, because you're just holding one bar. With this, you have two independent bars, right? So. That's what makes it great. Obviously, you could still do um, hammer curls like so with a regular barbell, right? Um, overhand grip, or you could also do just regular curls. But as you can tell, it would be hitting you in the thigh. So this is also great for regular curls because you independently work each of them. Another exercise you can do is, let's grab a bigger dumbbell. So we have, obviously, the longer one here. So if you can't do bent over rows with a barbell, right? Because it's a lot of pressure in your lower back, right? Barbell bent over rows, then you can do single arm rows, right? Narrow grip or neutral grip right here. Or you could also do wide grip, elbows up, right? So that way you protect your back. I'm just gonna do the other side, right? So you protect your back because you have the other forearm down there, right? So again, this is for people who have uh, lower back issues. So chest flies, that's one thing you can do with a barbell. So if you miss doing chair flies, or sorry, chest flies, this is the way to go. Obviously, if you have a bench, which I don't have right now, then I could get deeper into the exercise. Ooh, should have uh, either worked out more or lessened the load. So that's one thing you can do with a bar. Another great exercise I like to do for my triceps is uh, tricep extensions. So you can't do that with a bar. Ooh, that's pretty heavy. Squeeze that down, all right. All right, so this is something you can't really do with a bar, right? So as you can tell, it's super, super versatile. All right, so I hope you like those exercises. Obviously, I like this. Um, Olympic lifters will definitely not like this. So check it out and let us know what you think. Hope you like that. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out. Thanks for watching, guys.